But as I'm lining up to get this, this is Orion, uh, his belt on the bottom. When you see three stars in the sky, that is how you locate the constellation of Orion. By locating these three stars that are exactly the same, one beside the other, the one in the middle is just to say a hair lower. Oh no. Wait a minute. It's here. <laughs> this is the asteroid. Look, it's right there. What the heck was this one? Hold on. There's another one here? Or is that a planet? It looks pretty weird. So it's right by the post again. Right there in the sky. And here I'm thinking for some reason it's Venus, but Venus is actually down out of the horizon. There it is. And you know what? Same shape as the one I just showed you in the other photo. Definitely. Look at the craters again. One, two, three, four. This is amazing. The moon and the asteroid is underneath the moon again. But you, do you see how the asteroid looks a lot closer to Earth's orbit than the moon? There you go, guys. I got an even nicer image of that asteroid that's up over. So I'm getting four or five different images now. We'll try to collect them. And you know what? I'm seeing that a purple object over here. I don't know if I'm mixing myself up. You know what? I, I, think, I'm, uh, I think there's more than one. I think in the lower atmosphere there are uh, smaller dark celestial bodies like this that are hard to, uh, to see. We're going to go see the surface a bit closer, and I do have a closer shot. And this, it's, it's intriguing. I'm just going to let you guys see it. So you see the white that is on it is de most definitely why I was getting a purple, purplish hue and the dark gray here. What do we see around it? Everyone, the characteristics, the ones of you in UK and England and uh, elsewhere, there's three or four of you, if not five, that told me that you saw this particular one near the moon in the vicinity. Now look, here at the back, you can see where the light looks like pieces of light. It's not pieces of light, it's the tail. It has um, a round head-like area and it goes in to the back sort of like a tail. And it has a very humongous crater-like area on it. It's very prominent, very big. And you know what? There's, there's so many anomalies on this little piece of celestial void floating over my house. So guys, the asteroid is not in the lower atmosphere of Earth. It's actually in the high atmosphere of Earth, very high atmosphere. But the asteroid is high up in the atmosphere. But you see, it's, it's not um, close to the moon. It's actually uh, in distance. I'm This is on January 7th. I can tell by the date that's on my album because it, it looks like, could it be the asteroid? I wonder if you can see the craters from here, guys. I can. See that? It's the gray asteroid again with the humongous craters, two or three humongous craters by the post again. 
and the moon's right up here in the same place. Is that asteroid keeping track of it?